Hi, I'm Andy at Olympic Park Sports Medicine Centre. My patient today is Brett Rosebery, AFL umpire. So, just doing some massage techniques for pre-max. Uh, this is a way to warm up lumbar spine in, a, in an athlete, perhaps prior to competition. Um, and so I'm going to use some cream here to really try and get some warmth and some mobility through the lumbar spine in a seated flex position. So you can see here with just a little bit of cream, you need some you need something with a bit of grip. Not massage oils too uh, too subtle for this. Too, too uh, it allows you get too much, uh, not enough friction. So I want to get a bit of heat. As you can see, Brett's back is already becoming nice and red. Doesn't take long at all. I'm not doing a lot of pressure into his back. It's more just trying to get a good bit of grip, more friction. So I'm using my whole hand, I've got index and middle finger either side of his spine, I'm pressing down with the other hand over the top, and I'm going to one side of the spine and the other. You can start this from right up mid thoracic spine down to lumbar, you can fan out right onto the iliac crest, get right down to that, onto that sacral multifidus. So within 30 to 40 seconds, you've really warmed up the back. You've really got some really good extensibility into your rectus spiny muscles. And improving that athlete's flexion. And now I've got Brett in sideline. Just another few techniques uh, in this, this idea of getting an athlete warmed up prior to competition. So we might do some, some soft tissue techniques through quadratus lumborum. So starting at the iliac crest, I'm just doing some subtle on-off mobilising or, or soft tissue techniques through there. I'm actually out quite laterally over his transverse processes, getting right into his quadratus lumborum. Now you can increase the, uh, the stretch on that muscle by taking his arm overhead and even lengthening that top leg. And that might make it easier to, to find areas of increased tone, tenderness in that quadratus muscle there. And in that same position you can slide down onto his erector spiny, starting laterally, coming down. His muscles are on a length and position. And because this is pre-event technique that I'm doing, I'm keeping it quite fast, trying to aim to get a lot of blood flow through those muscles for quite a bit of superficial redness. And you can come right down onto the top of the gluteal muscles at the same time. Same sort of position, starting laterally, starting at the uh, ASIS and heading right round to the PSIS.